Hello, I'm Nick, the therapeutic nurse-patient relationship, and in particular, we're going to be talking about the working phase. Now, as an astute nursing student that you are, we know that there are four phases, four distinct phases of the therapeutic nurse-patient relationship. The first of these is what? It's the pre-orientation phase, followed by the orientation phase, then the working phase, and then finally, when we say goodbye during the termination phase. As I said before, today we're going to be talking about the working phase of the therapeutic nurse-patient relationship. Now, what happens during the working phase of the therapeutic nurse-patient relationship? Well, at solving their problems. Now, we know in mental health nursing, again, being the astute nursing student that you are, that in mental health nursing, it's most of the mental health problems that we deal with in our patients uh, deal with the patient's inability to cope. So we're dealing here with an inability to deal or an inability to cope. And during the working phase, you as a nurse need to work with the patient in order to develop coping skills, coping mechanisms, or way to deal with problems um, that they uh, that the patient is experiencing. For example, if a patient is suffering from um, obsessive compulsive disorder or OCD, you as a nurse might during the working phase uh, engage in either group or probably in this case individual therapy or uh, or any you know some if they go to a physician psychotherapy in order to help them identify triggers uh, that might bring on their OCD or maybe explore the reasons behind their OCD in an attempt to help alleviate the patient's OCD in which case they would move on later to the termination phase. So the working phase is a time where the nurse is going to be spending a lot of time with the patient working with the patient actively uh, in the care plan in order to help them alleviate and um, to defeat their mental health problems or at least hopefully make them better. Thank you for watching. Best of luck on your nursing school exam or NCLEX, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.